Cuando mi mamá no tuvo la oportunidad de estar en una escuela, ella no sabe leer ni escribir. Eh, ahorita solo ella está trabajando en la casa. Mi papá también no tuvo la oportunidad de estudiar en una escuela. Él también no sabe escribir ni leer. Y ahorita solo él está trabajando eh, como agricultor. Mis padres decían que yo ya no seguía a estudiar porque ellos me decían que ya no, ya no tenían dinero de pagar mi colegiatura y de comprar eh, algunos cuadernos. Chahul is still recovering from genocidal massacres experienced during the 36-year civil war that finally ended in 1996. An isolated indigenous Maya Ishil community, few adults can read and most families live on less than $2 a day. Limitless Horizons Ishil is rooted in this community, and we believe that education is the cornerstone of creating a brighter future, both for the individual and for the community. Eh, me involucré con Horizonte eh, cuando yo estudiaba en básico. Ellos me brindaban, eh, me daban útiles escolares y yo recibía eh, el dinero en cada mes y para pagar mi colegiatura y comprar mis materiales didácticos para mis trabajos. En Guatemala, elementary school is free, but middle school and high school can be costly. 93% of Chahul's residents live in poverty. For them, it is nearly impossible to find the money to spend on school expenses. Anna Asakona joined Limitless Horizons East Shill's youth development program upon her entry to middle school and was supported financially and academically until her graduation from high school. Our youth development program not only provides financial scholarships, but also much needed services of support such as additional Spanish language classes, life skills workshops, mentoring, and access to a computer lab. Limitless Horizons East Shell's community library, the first and only public library in Chahul, creates a better study environment for students, and for younger children, it instills and fosters a love of learning and literacy early on. Me gusta eh, ser maestra y trabajar con los niños. Eh, uno de mis metas es eh, que los niños lleguen a la biblioteca, que ellos eh, sepan leer y escribir. One of our newer initiatives is an internship program, which provides professional skill development and workshops. Ana Asakona is one of the first batch of interns to enter this program. Soy practicante bibliotecaria en la Biblioteca Pública de Horizonte. Eh, ahí estoy trabajando también en la oficina de Horizonte. Anna and her mother are actively involved in the Artisan Program, which provides opportunities for students and their mothers to use their traditional weaving skills to make beautiful hand-woven artisan products that Limitless Horizons Ishiel sells abroad and online on their behalf. They, along with the other participants, are paid a fair wage for their work. Eh, el programa de artesanía es muy importante y impactante para las madres eh, a buscar eh, un poco de dinero y apoyar a la vez a sus hijos en su estudio. Looking ahead, in addition to increasing the impact of our current work, Limitless Horizons Ishiel is focusing on deepening our collaboration with local partner schools so we can improve the quality of education, not just for our students, but for the entire community of Chahuo. Eh, Horizonte me ha apoyado en ser un, una profesional en mi familia y cumplí mi visión de ser profesional y ser alguien en la vida porque esto no tenía en mi mente si yo, fue, si yo me graduaría de ser profesional, pero gracias a Horizonte es porque ellos me apoyaron en mi familia y estoy muy feliz. Together we make the dreams of youth and women and community possible. Graduates of our program are thriving. In a community where only 3% of youth graduate from high school, 40% of our graduates go on to university. They are employed in good jobs. And like many of her peers, Anna Asakona is the first professional in her family, allowing her to support her family and serve as an important role model in the community. Limitless Horizons Ishiel is the only organization of its kind in Chahul, and the benefits of our critical work extend throughout changing the future of a scarred society by creating leaders like Anna Asakona who will know the limitless possibilities of their community. <laughs>